First, 10 Tampa Bay's Emerald Morrow, listen in on today's CDC conference call where the director announced the change in guidelines. Emerald explains why the changes and the science that forced Dr. Walensky's hand. The Delta variant is showing every day its willingness to outsmart us. And as the variant surges and new data shows even vaccinated people can be contagious, now the CDC is changing course when it comes to masks. In areas with substantial and high transmission, CDC recommends fully vaccinated people wear masks in public indoor settings. It's a shift from the CDC's relaxed mask guidance in May. When they said vaccinated people don't need to wear a mask anymore, I think a lot of people heard masks optional for everybody. And so now it's going to be really difficult to change that message back. People on social media already frustrated with the constantly changing rules. The CDC says in May, the alpha variant made them believe those with vaccines could not transmit the virus. Doctors say that's not so with the Delta variant. Even though you're vaccinated, you can get it and you can spread it. Despite the new guidance, there are no mandates in sight for Florida as Governor DeSantis has reiterated. But remember, private businesses can still ask you to mask up. It is um, not a welcomed piece of news that masking is going to be a part of people's lives who have already been vaccinated. This new guidance weighs heavily on me, and I just wanted to convey that this was not a decision that was taken lightly. It's the right guidance to mask. It's the right guidance to physically distance. It's the right guidance to get vaccinated. Now, right now, if you're fully vaccinated, the chances of you ending up in the hospital or dying is slim to none. So the shot is the best protection. Experts say you can't rely on vaccinated people around you to keep you safe. Previously, scientists thought that vaccinated people who got COVID may have less of their virus in their system to pass on to others. But Dr. Walensky gave us a sharper insight into the new data here now. In these outbreak investigations, we are able to stratify the um, clusters that we are seeing. Unfortunately, because we have so much disease right now, some of these clusters are large and we're able to stratify them by a smaller proportion that are vaccinated and breakthrough infections and a larger proportion that are unvaccinated. What we're seeing is that they're actually quite similar. That leads us to believe that the breakthrough infections, rare as they are, have the potential to forward transmit at the same, um, with the same capacity as an unvaccinated person. Now look, vaccines are not foolproof, but they're the best weapon we have. So crucial, the presidents of Florida's 12 state universities are now banding together, asking students to get vaccinated before coming back in the fall.